triangles. What type of triangles, class? They're special right triangles. We're going to be focusing on these quite a bit this semester. <coughs> the first one has 30 degrees. So if you have a highlighter, it's helpful. This one says 30 degrees. So this is my starting point. From here, I have a missing one. This should have been radical 3. You have going across the side is called the what class? Opposite. The one across the right angle is called the hypotenuse. And the last one is called the adjacent. Class sign is which two sides? Opposite over the hypotenuse. Remember, if you forget, you can use the silly phrase. So, ka, toa. Opposite over the hypotenuse. <coughs> so the opposite is 1. The hypotenuse, h, is 2. So sine of 30 degrees is equal to 1 half. Raise your hand if you got that. Let's go ahead and try now cosine of 45. Class, which triangle is cosine? I'm sorry, which, which triangle is 45 degrees? The right one. Now, there are two 45 degrees, so you can actually pick either of these to start with. If I go across, this is called the opposite. This one is called the hypotenuse across the right angle. And the last side is called the adjacent. Class, which two sides is cosine? Adjacent over the hypotenuse. So my adjacent side is what? And my hypotenuse is? A common mistake I've been hearing from students is here, to simplify, students are saying the reciprocal. The reciprocal is incorrect. <coughs> reciprocal means to flip the fraction. In this case, we're going to multiply by 1. Everyone say multiply 1. Multiplying by 1 is rationalizing the denominator. It removes the denominator, it removes the radical from the denominator. So if you multiply across, class 1 times radical 2, and radical 2 times radical 2 is, and radical 4 is 2. Cosine of 45 degrees is radical 2 over 2. And the last one. Class, which triangle is 60 degrees? It's the left one, so I'm going to put highlight my starting point. Now, pay attention. Although this triangle is already uh, labeled, I have to relabel it based on the starting angle. Class, this side now becomes the opposite. This one is the, so it's still the hypotenuse. And then the last side is the adjacent. Class, which two sides is tangent? Opposite over the adjacent. So then I just look over here on my triangle. The opposite is radical 3. The adjacent is 1. Therefore, the tangent of 60 degrees is equal to radical 3. So I would recommend, uh, as I've color-coded it as well, uh, highlight your starting point, label your triangle, use SOKOTOA, and you can find your answer.